I'm looking at you. It's fine. So it's like a, this would be like a half one, right? Yeah. Like, welcome to episode 13 and a half of the Glug. 13 and a half. 13 and a half. It's 13 and a half. Episode of the Glug. He said. <laughs> Welcome, Meredith, to the uh, table tonight. We're going to do a quick one for uh, Sleigh Bell Weekend here in Manistee. There's been lots of activity already. There's, There's a, a soup riot. Yeah. There was a, a literal soup, soup? riot. Riot. <laughs> Flowing out into the streets of Manistee. Yeah. I've never seen anything like this before in my life. I mean, I've I mean, lived like, here my whole life, dude. And when they started doing the soup cook-off thing, I'm like, who? You pour it up. Who, who, who goes out and eats a bunch of two ounce pours of soup? When it's less than twenty degrees outside, the wind chill is like negative five. I'm guessing. I mean, apparently the entire county. I mean, <laughs> apparently the weather is horrible. It's pretty cold outside. But the soup is so delightful. It is. The, the weather, weather outside, outside is, is frightful. frightful, but the Get it right. soup. It's so, so delightful. Delight. Was cause it's Was cause. It went quick. <laughs> so tonight, we're gonna sip on, or not sip on, well, Eric probably wants to sip on it, cause I was like, let's have a whole beer. And he's like, I don't wanna I have a whole sipping. beer. And I'm like, we gotta have a full beer tonight. We're only doing one beer. Let's have a full beer. Meredith agreed. Yeah, cause we earned it. Yeah, we did earn it today. Thanks, Justin, here's to Scar earn it. Here's the earning it. <laughs> <laughs> scary Jesus rock star. I like my Jesus to be a little scary and rock star ish. It's the pale ale brewed with apricots and chamomile or chamomile. And you look so excited. Chamomile. About it. Yeah. <laughs> this is a collaboration with Chief Cletus. Cletus? Friedman. I don't know. I don't know who I don't know who, uh, who the chief, Cletus Friedman is, but I don't know either. But you could Google it with us. Probably. Yeah. Cletus Friedman will save your soul and then melt your face off. That sounds amazing. Okay, this doesn't sound like Christmas to me. Aromas of chamomile touch your nose as they lead into the soft body. <laughs> And your favorite word, mouthfeel oh, of geez. this liquid symphony. Wait, mouthfeel is on this can? Wait, but it's, Wait. It's, it's super good. Just as your mind is clear and your sins are washed away, yeah. a tasty riff of sweet and earthy fresh apricots uh, hits the palate uh, and rocks your taste buds. Uh, um, did you take a drink yet? Rock on! Happy. No, because nobody... It is fantastic. Okay. Oh, we got uh, cheers. Cheers. I'm all guggling. My bad. Bottom cheeser. <laughs> mm. Yeah. You just want to take a minute. It's delightful. I think it's delightful. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. That's I'm really not, good. And I'm not big on yeah. fruity bears. I don't like fruity beer. <laughs> I, I think it's pretty good. I like fruity people, but not fruity beers. Yeah. Usually. That's all I have to say about that. Tasty. That's tasty. That's really good. good amount I don't know who won the soup cook-off. Did you... Get a chance to find out who won. Apparently, it's seven o'clock. No, rigged oh. it as much as I possibly could, but I'm really hoping that we win. You I win. don't really care if we win. I kind of care if we win. All I know is that everybody that walked out of here and tasted that soup was like, "That's a five. That's a five. I actually had a woman pull me to the side, like, "Excuse me, hold on just one second. If that recipe shows up on Facebook, I will not be upset." And I'm like, excuse me, ma'am? And she's like, I need that recipe. No mas. Sorry. It's not happening. I don't know if uh, Mama D is willing to share that with the, yeah. with the internet. It's my mom's soup recipe with a little uh, James, James <laughs> spin off. Up. It was pretty good. And I it pours it up. It up. Oh, no. It up. I put some bacon. That was some, some ham bits. James, how much do I love soup? You don't love soup at all. I hate soup. Oh, look, it's a ham bush. Yeah. <laughs> what? I hate soup. 
I hate soup a lot. It's a BBC thing. But that soup is amazing. So what's going on tomorrow? Sleigh Bell. Mm -hmm. Sleigh Bell Parade. Sleigh Bell Parade 5 at 5.30. Santa Claus is coming. Santa is coming. I know him. <laughs> Too tough. I'm uh, the calm one. Beer tasting. Big Lake Brewery. What time is that? Donna Manistee Beverage at 3 o'clock till 5. 3 to 5. Who's, who's hosting that? Uh, we are at Manistee Beverage. Yeah, but who's like the host it? <laughs> the host of the most, the bartender deluxe, Mr. Eric Rose. People, 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 people. You know, poor's are going to be liberal. Um, they're going to be what they're supposed to be. I mean, within legal limits. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Beer cheese soup will be served. Spinach artichoke dip. Yep. Take your lactate pills. Take your lactate. Yep, it's lactate. gonna be a ton of fun. I think we crushed it today. There was like 200 people in here at one time. It was ridiculous. They, yep. Yep. Not able like, to get in and like, out of the doors. This is my first sleigh bell weekend in Manistee. And I was like, what's gonna go on? That. And then the next thing I know, is there are people walking in the door like, where's the soup? Yeah, I'm here but for the soup. With a spoon in their hand. I'm, I'm sorry. Here for the soup. There's not any le any soup left. There's no soup left. <laughs> no soup for you. I curse you. I curse you. Yeah. Yeah. It was crazy. So next year we have a cauldron and we're just Stir up soup, like giant amounts of soup. Oh, because yeah, that'll be amazing next year. Sure. How much you made? Seven gallons. Seven gallons of soup. Gallons of soup. Do you not understand? even? You can't put it was your an arms hour around before, that. It was an hour before it was over. Yeah. It was gone. Mm -hmm. Two ounces. Seven gallons of soup. It's a lot of With soup. Two ounce pours. Yeah, we were giving a little extra here and there, but yeah. Like, I can't even, I, like, I, I don't even know that I can fathom seven gallons. Are you feeling really relaxed from the chamomile in this <laughs> here? Because my day has just suddenly come to a chill. It's legal now in Michigan to smoke marijuana. <laughs> <laughs> somebody, somebody had an edible. No, there's, no. there's chamomile, there's chamomile in, the in the beer. Yeah. Yeah. No. <laughs> She's just camel in the beer. Wanna rate it? Scary Jesus Rockstar? Uh, I feel I, I feel bad rating this beer. I don't. Because Scary Jesus is on the Because scary Jesus. I mean Jesus he's scary. Look at the six pack on Jesus. I uh, I don't know. I'm gonna give Maybe it a Maybe what they mean to say is scary Jesus. This isn't I think it is. It's scary, Jesus. Yes, it's scary. Um, Meredith, ladies, go first. Okay, so... Because I'm not a fruity beer drinker, I'll rate it against all the rest of my fruity beers that I've had, and I'll say 4.5. It's a good rating. It's a good rating. It's a great rating. Might even tip in the 4.75. Even better. It's fantastic. Mm -hmm. Eric, what do you think? I think this beer walks on water. <laughs> Which means... And I honestly feel that if I took this beer somewhere and I only had six beers but 150 people showed up... you just keep pouring. It would just keep pouring it out of the same glass. <laughs> and it would just keep pouring. It's true. Because... That's like how would... my beer magically stays full. Yeah, exactly. However, Matt Meredith's beer stays full. It's crazy. Yep. So I'm gonna give it a magical six pack. <laughs> wow. Yep. You're not playing. Six nope. pack for the six pack. On, yep. On you gave it a sixer, huh? Well. Yeah. Four point well, five for like me. I this, was is a, this is a, this is a, this is a damn good beer. And James went four point five. I've never given a beer six pack. Well, you never hear me rate right? because I'm usually doing it silently. But. <laughs> Silently judging. Silently I do. I silently, silently judging. judging. Usually on the other side of the camera. Silently 
Judge. Are you guys good? This is the moment of the show where we're gonna give the um, the recipe for the soup. Yeah. Okay. So, so it starts first things with, first, you put in a little bit 